Hi everyone! Today let's make a simple but nutritious healthy rice dish with a popular ingredient in the fall which is butternut squash. You will love how pretty the dish turns out and how yummy it tastes. Let's begin! Oh yeah! Helen's recipes! You will need 1 cup of brown rice, 50 gram raisins, 1 butternut squash, a tablespoon of minced leek, the white part only, 50 gram of tofu, 50 gram of straw mushroom, 10 gram of green pea, 50 gram lotus root, and 50 gram of carrot. Firstly, cut off the ground of the baby pumpkin or butternut squash. Keep the dense part in the middle for another dish. Scoop out the fibrous part inside along with the seeds with a spoon and discard. We will use this as a bowl for our rice dish. You can carve the brim to make it look pretty. Now soak brown rice for about 1 hour until softened and then put in an electric rice cooker, pouring water at the same level with the rice and press to cook. Next, dice carrot, lotus root, tofu, and finely chop the mushrooms. The vegetables and mushrooms will give the dish more colors, textures, and nutrition. Next, heat oil in a pan and fry the tofu until golden and crispy. Remove and then leave some oil in the pan. Add the minced leek, just the white part, and saute until fragrant. Then add the mushrooms, stir well, and then add the carrots, the diced lotus root, green peas, and fried tofu. Also add the raisins. and season with 2 teaspoons soy sauce and half a teaspoon of vegetable stock powder. Then add the cooked brown rice and stir well and then transfer the rice into the pumpkin. Drizzle some sesame oil and put in the steamer and steam for about 20 to 30 minutes depending on the size of the butternut squash. Wow, the final dish couldn't be more beautiful. The rice has a really tasty flavor mixed with the colorful and crunchy vegetables and the sweet and soft raisins, which is absolutely delicious. Please give it a try and send me some photos if you do. Don't forget to share my video with your friends. I will see you then next time. Thank you for watching. Bye!